what is existing today, which I don't have so much of strong faith in it, that how did it happen? But it is there today. What's going to happen tomorrow, the uncertainty for tomorrow, that is too much of a worrying kind of factor. Uncertainty. Okay, so your, your main challenge is uncertainty. Yeah, and the Sufis say nicely, they say you can plan for a hundred years. You can plan for a hundred years, but you don't know what's going to happen in the next second. Right? You can plan as much as you want, but we don't know what if somebody's going to throw a bomb here in the next second. Right? So yeah, I mean life is uncertain. And just like a corporate guru or a corporate entrepreneur uh, lives in an uncertain environment in business, a Sufi, when he or she goes into meditation, goes on the unknown. You, you're quiet, you're closing your eyes, you're praying, it's dark. What do you expect? It's certain. Unknown. So there are similarities in the spiritual world being unknown. What will happen after you die? Do you know? So life is uncertain, business is uncertain, our spiritual journey is uncertain. And great entrepreneurs have become successful because they are comfortable with uncertainty. They thrive on uncertainty. 